What's up travel lovers? Today I have a special treat for you. I'm going to be reviewing the Viking River Cruises. I've wanted to do this for a long time. If you want to find out what makes this trip so special, come with me. I was invited on the romantic Danube eight-day cruise that started in Budapest and ended in Nuremberg. Going into this, I had extremely high expectations. However, I can gladly say it lived up to all the hype. Now, most of the people on the trip were 55 years and older, but I'm here to share with you 10 reasons everyone should go on a Viking River cruise. Number one, see Europe from your bed. That is right. My absolute favorite thing about the cruise was sitting on my bed and watching the scenery pass by. It is, hands down, the most comfortable way to travel. I highly suggest getting the veranda stateroom for the best bang for your buck. One full wall is glass, and it includes a modest balcony. The room is cozy and very practical. Number two, small boat. Our ship was a long ship with 95 cabins total. I'm not a huge cruise fan, mainly because I always feel crowded, but this was not the case. Not once did I have to fight for a chair or wait in a long line. For this reason, I know I will be back to River Cruise again. By the end of the trip, I had nearly met all the other passengers. Number three, epic scenery. I was blessed to be traveling in the fall. From the main deck, you could get 360 degree views of some of the most breathtaking scenery while lying in a lounge chair with your favorite beverage. This became the overall highlight of the trip. I spent the most amount of time just watching the horizon from sunrise to sunset. Number four, luxurious. This state-of-the-art boat was made for a king. You could tell they spared no expense in decorating the interior of the boat. So even if it was too cold to be outside, you could still enjoy from inside. Number five, staff. The real difference between a good experience and a fantastic experience comes down to the service. The staff on my boat were delightful and always close by when I had a question, no matter how ridiculous the question. Within a couple of days, most of the staff had remembered my name, which was a nice touch that made the experience that much better. Number six, stops in Europe's top cities. Many of the Viking River Cruises take you to a variety of countries, stopping along the way in some of Europe's most popular cities, as well as some small, charming towns you've probably never heard of. So this is a great way to explore Europe for the first time. Number seven, convenient. This is a real vacation that allows everyone to enjoy the experience equally. Everything is meticulously planned for your convenience. Several tours are available at each stop. There are two different places to enjoy your meals and there is always the option to be served. One of the advantages to cruises versus other modes of travel is the ability to visit many places and only needing to move your suitcase once. Number eight, food. Generally on cruises, the area of most weakness is in the quality of the food. I can honestly say the food was the best I've ever had on a cruise. The food was not Michelin star or anything out of this world, but it was very tasty with good presentation and most importantly, variety. I also noticed the chef was always on hand to accommodate any of the passengers' dietary requirements. Number nine. Beverages. Lunch and dinner included a complimentary wine or beer. The ship's bar was stocked with some excellent options, and if you like to drink, I can tell you the Silver Spirits drink package is well worth the money, and better than any other drink package I have ever seen to date, which is worth cheersing to. Number 10, all-inclusive. 
Once you have booked your trip, everything is included. Food and beverages are free, several free tours are included in each port, and complimentary wireless internet. So the only thing you could have to pull your wallet out for is to pay for some souvenirs or if you want to go on one of the specialized tours. Alrighty, well, unfortunately my cruise is coming to an end. I had a fantastic time. If you have any questions, leave them in the comment box below. If you like this video, go ahead and like it, and even better would be to subscribe. Well, until next time, see you later. Don't leave yet. There's tons of great videos to keep watching. More importantly, did you subscribe yet?